Okay, so ang next software naman natin ngayon ay what you called the hat. Okay, so kung napag-download na kayo, just double click the software. Click yes. Next. I accept the agreement. Next. 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 Create a desktop icon. So, next. And then install. And then launch the hat. Okay, pag-launch natin. So, obviously, buray mo natin ito kasi nag-try na rin ako kanina. So, dapat may ready na kayo na names. So, kung, may, kung wala pa, I just type it in Excel para at least uh, mas organize yung names. So, since I have here 60 names na ito yung mga previous students' names ko. So, ang gagawin ko lang is Control Shift, Hold, and then Arrow Down para makopy ako ng buo. Then, control c for copy and then control v for paste. May mga instances na nakikita lang dito is 1 to 20. Okay, so ang gawin mo lang dyan para makopy mo lahat is control v lang uli. Create new list and then click OK. Okay, so yan. So dito, if you want to edit names, pwede kang pumunta rito. Ayan, edit names. Okay. Mag-remove ka ng names, mag-clear ka ng list. Sample clear list natin yan. O, yan, yan. Okay. Just paste it. And then, pwede ka mag-add ng individual names dito naman sa icon na to. Okay. So, since uh, itatry natin to, let's click shuffle. Pag-click natin yung shuffle, yun, yun, yun na yung ano, shinapple niya yung names. Then, click mo tong the hat na icon. So, ito, pag-start ng klase mo, you have 60 students. Sa limbawa, pwede yung members of 12 then draw names mo siya. Ayan. So, no need to call them one by one. So, yung mismo software na gagawa ng trabaho mo. At the same time, matipreserve mo yung voice mo. Okay? So, yan. So, group 1 up to group 5. Kung ano ba, hanggang group 5 ka na, good news, pwede mo siyang i-print or i-save mo yung file. For example, sige, tapusin natin ang group, group 5. So, this is group 2. So, kung meron kang 5 sections to 6 sections, mas maganda itong gamitin kasi bakit uh, mas madaling mag-groupings ano, mag kasi boys, girls, naka-shuffle siya. Okay? So, ito rin is to prevent ng mga magtatropa na magkakagroup sila. Okay? So, at least ma-expose din naman sila sa ibang tao. So, this is group, group 4. Okay? So, antay mo lang siya. And the last group. Okay? So, ganyan lang easy. You're going to use the hat. So, walang ka-pressure, pressure. Just click draw names. Okay? And then, kung may printer ka, print mo. Pero kung wala, just save it. Okay? So, ito, naggawa na ako ng folder dito. Pangalan niya is groupings. Then, section 1. Eh, depende kung ano section mo siya. Tapos, save mo lang siya dyan as groupings. Okay? So, ano ba itsura nito? Pag tinignan natin, so, ganito itsura niya. So, the documents, the groupings. Okay? So, na-preserve mo yung 5 groups in each section. Okay? So, another way of using this is, example, ito yung name, Shuffle. Pag-graded recitation, no? kaya nagpapag-games ka. For example, uh, lima lang yung tatawagin mo. Sila yung magsasagot dun sa question mo. Ako kasi mga teacher ako. Tumahili ko mag-board uh, game. So, yan. Yan. For example naman, halimbawa, tatlo lang ang tatawagin mo. Okay? So, this is graded recitation. Okay, dalawa. Okay, pwede dalawa. Sa ibang subject, pwede rin siyang gamitin actually for grade recitation. Ang good news yan, pwede mo siyang isave. So, sila yung nag-recitation sa'yo. Type mo naman, recitation. Or graded recitation. Di ba? So, ang, ang dali lang ng trabaho ni teacher. So, kahit ilang section pa yan. Okay? So, example pa, ng paano paggamit nito is, example, meron kang presentation. Example, group presentation ka. 1, group 2, group 3, 
to four, four, and group five. Okay, so shuffle natin siya. Sobra. Hit natin yan. Ayan. Shuffle natin siya. And then, click mo in the hat. First group to present. Group four. Group two. Next group. Group three. Next group is group five. And the last group is group one. So, every day kung gagawin mo to, iba iba yung group na nagpe-present. So, mas ma-enjoy nila. Okay? And then, mas maganda rin to. May team din dito. Pwede mo rin siya change every day. Ah, diba? Diba? Uh, that's it. So, that's the use of uh, the hat. So, ang challenge ko ngayon is to create your own practice it. And then, gawa ka ng isang list ng names na pwede mo pag-practice. God bless!